What is up everybody and welcome to Everything's Plastic. Today we're going to be taking a look at a Jack specific Sonic the Hedgehog and this is a very cool, very awesome Blaze. This is one of the few that we actually needed. Uh, we don't have any Blaze figures in our collection. We'll start by getting a closer look at packaging. Just your standard card figure. Uh, nice clear packaging all the way around. The Sonic the Hedgehog logo. We have Jack specific logo down the bottom here. Accessory included and on the back here we have 12 points of articulation. We have three pictures here that actually showcase the articulation. And up top here it says Blaze with Soul Emerald. Hopefully I'm saying that right. There's a quick little read up on top that says Blaze is a princess from another dimension with the ability to control fire. Though she may seem standoffish, she is kind at heart. Cool. And this is the other four figures in the wave. I'm pretty sure we have Sonic, Shadow, and Knuckles. We have so many different versions of Shadow, <laughs> Sonic, and Knuckles. I can barely tell the waves apart now. That pretty much wraps up packaging. We'll be right back with Blaze outside off the package to get a closer look. Yeah. All right, four accessories. Blaze comes with a Soul Emerald. And you can see that this is a uh, translucent hollow plastic. And it has a little hole right here. But yeah, pretty cool. It does look, does look nice. She can't hold on to it or anything like that, but uh, at least we got an accessory. Really like her eyes. I like how it's painted. We have eyelashes coming out here. Our ears are painted decent. We have this little red uh, spot on top of her forehead. Like I said, I'm not uh, really up on this character. Her mouth, nose, all that stuff is painted. We have a band going around her right here. This is painted pretty decent. Actually, two different pieces of plastic. So the body is painted nice as well. There's a little tiny defect in the mold right here. You can see that the plastic is kind of uh, chipped and discolored. Other than that, lower body looks good. Uh, paint application on the shoes are decent, not perfect. We do have some pink paint right here is not covered all the way. So we do have white uh, trim going around here. Bono boots are painted decent. Not a bad looking blaze figure. Overall appearance of this one is pretty decent. Overall, cute little tail. I like it. So for this one, like I previously mentioned, when we were looking at packaging, there is 12 points of articulation. So for our head, spins all the way around. We do get a little bit of wiggle side to side, whether we're supposed to have it or not. It's there. Shoulder goes up this far, rotates all the way around, and it spins all the way around this way. Her wrist spin all the way around. As for the legs, it goes forward this far, back this far, a little bit restricted by her jacket. Can't come out to a complete split. Get a 90 degree bend at the knee and her feet spins all the way around and the tail is articulated as well that kind of moves all the way around if you really really want it i think it goes all the way around should go all the way around but the jacket kind of restricts it there we go yeah cool whatever way you want to have it this way kind of looks more natural in my personal opinion but well, here we have it 12 points of articulation so i'm going to keep this review nice and quick because we have more toys to play with and you guys have better things to do than to listen to me talk about toys. So overall, I'm going to give this one an 8 out of 10. Uh, the paint application on this one is decent. Uh, not perfect, but it's not that bad to be completely honest. A few spots where the paint is kind of not enough paint and a little bit over paint in certain places. The accessory is decent. Uh, just a hollow piece of translucent plastic, which is not too bad at uh, this day and age. Uh, it's just good to have an accessory. So I think an 8 out of 10 is a pretty decent score for this one. As always, let me know what you think of our score of 8 out of 10. Let us know what you think of our review. And what do you guys think of Blaze? Let me know in the comments below as well. Who is your favorite Sonic the Hedgehog character of all time? If you like the review, don't forget, hit that like button and that subscribe button is there as well. If you guys want to support the channel, we do have a channel membership. We do have a Patreon and a merchandise store as well. All the links are in the description below. As always, my friends, we hope you enjoyed this review and we hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Keep collecting, stay safe, go buy some toys.